um, Yazoo County freshman, uh, cornerback Chris Fox. Tonight you led um, the team with eight tackles and one forced fumble. How do you feel about tonight's game? I feel I didn't, I didn't play to the best of my ability. I feel we could have did a lot more to win the game. Northeast had some big plays tonight on um, some busted coverage in the secondary. What happened there? Was there a mix-up in coverage? A couple plays they had that broke because we, we didn't get the call across the whole secondary. And this side playing in main and the other side playing zone, and we're not picking up our receivers we're supposed to pick up. It, it appeared to be the same receiver every time, too. I think it was number seven who – I can't remember his name off the top of my head, but he had, I think, 190-something yards and three touchdowns. What was it about him that he seemed to be open every time? He Sometimes he went down to number two, then he moved out to number three. Then sometimes he played a wing back. He had come out and slip out, and we don't catch him. We didn't pick him up. Uh, you know, your first four games now through college football – you, had, you said you had signed a Division One, actually played fall camp there, uh, here because of grades, hoping to get those back up and, and to move back on. But just talk about maybe your first four games in college. You know, talk about is, is how much faster it is than Yazoo County, and just talk about maybe how you're adapting uh, through the first four weeks. Uh, college ball is a lot faster, a lot harder, and the coach is a lot tougher. Uh, I feel um, we need we. I feel it's a different level. I feel. Uh, I'm just learning, and I think I'm getting better week by week. You were in, you know, fall or spring camp uh, with Coach Wilkerson, and then you come and Coach Lawler comes into camp, uh, you know, two weeks after that, right before the season starts. What was it like having a new, basically, a defensive backs coach coming in right before the season? I mean, he brought a big difference. I mean, him and Coach Wilkerson, are big, they're two different people. They brought he, Coach Lawler brought a different stuff than Coach Wilkerson did, and it's, they, they changed a lot. The defense stayed the same, but we do different things and different drills and stuff like that. Well, a nice game from nice game from you tonight. Despite the loss, hopefully you can bounce back next week uh, at Itawamba. But uh, again, a good game from you. Uh, eight tackles and a forced fumble. Thank you.